everybody, Cindy A. Lewis here. Welcome, welcome, welcome. I'm so glad that you're here. Today, I'm just gonna do a really quick, easy fold library card for you to add to your journals, to your scrapbook pages, to your cards even if you want to. It's super easy, just get the dimensions, and then you can actually make it as big as you want to. So we're just gonna try it with some Christmas paper I have here at my desk. And thanks so much for watching, I appreciate it. Uh, let's just jump in. Okay, so we're just gonna pick a, a piece of paper from this paper pad that I have for Christmas. Of course, you could use scraps for this or anything that you want. So I'm just gonna pick one that's pretty easy to accent. And let's go with this blue plaid uh, for this one. Now, what you need to do is you need to cut your paper to be nine inches by three and a half inches. So we're gonna do that here. Just gonna cut this. This is an eight and a half by 11. So I'm gonna cut it uh, three and a half inches, which seems to be right down that line there. So you know you can make more. And we're gonna cut this at nine inches. So let me get this pulled out here. And nine inches is right there. So. The next thing that you want to do is score for your fold. So we're gonna score up three inches. So we're gonna go one, two, three. So my score line would be at three inches right here. We're just gonna go over that a couple times. And here we are on our fold and just score up. And you can already see your library card coming together. Now, the next thing that you wanna do to make it look more like a library card is actually round those edges. So I went to get my all-in-one because it does have a corner rounder on it. And what I need to do is round the corners to make it look like a library card. So right here is my corner rounder. I'm just gonna slide this in and round that corner. And then I can do that also on this one. And it just rounds those corners so that you have a more rounded edge. And that's my dog. Hello, Hondo. And so then the next thing that you'll do is um, just glue down these two sides here. So you can choose double-sided tape or you can choose glue. I'm going to use double-sided tape. So I'm just going to put it along this edge and then along this edge. Here. Oh. So this becomes your library pocket. You just put whatever you in it you want. If you want a library card look, you can go ahead and cut out that manila file folder. And you can put that in there or you could put a tag or whatever you want. So I have um, some Christmas um, ephemera here and let's just pick something that would look good on, on this. This would be cute just to decorate it up a bit. Let's see if this is too big. No, I think that'll fit. And that'll be cute. And then if you wanna put something in here, you could do that also, just to give it um, a little decoration when it's not got everything in it. And you can do that. And then just take whatever it is that you wanna put in there and slide it in. So let's see if I have a little something to put in there. So just slide your tag in there if you want it to be a tag or you could slide your uh, decorations in there. You could put lace or a ribbon on here if you wanted to. You could take a little red ribbon and you could just put it over there. However you wanna decorate is up to you, but it's really simple to make the card. Nine inches, score at three, and it's three and a half inches wide. Hope you enjoyed this quick video.